Hi, good afternoon. Thank you so much for being here. The president of the 74th session of the General Assembly, Tijani Mohammed Bandi, will uh, make uh, remarks and then we'll open the floor to questions. Questions. You want to go ahead? No, let, let me ask questions. Of course. No. Go ahead, please. Do you have any questions? The, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, congratulations for your uh, being the PGA. Uh, my question is about Venezuela. Uh, yesterday, uh, opposition leader, the Mr. Guaido, uh, announced that the, uh, he's send, uh, sending the delegation to the uh, upcoming GA. So what, what do you respond to that? I don't have any information about that. So I would rather not speculate. Uh, in the case of that, uh, you have the uh, uh, mandate to set up the, some the really committee. What's a member of the committee? The, the members of the committee have been raised, have been announced, and there was no objection in terms of those who were elected. Nine members were announced, and these are the members that the House accepted. Okay. Sorry, I, I came a little bit late. Uh, can you just outline very shortly the priorities of your presidency? Well, I, I mentioned them severally, but what they are, naturally, every presidency will deal with peace and security issues. That is a permanent uh, element for the United Nations. In the 74th session, we are also prioritizing poverty eradication, zero hunger, quality, quality education, climate action and inclusion. All these are critical elements within the already agreed SDGs. And our task is to really take them together as interrelated and achieving each one of them will require also progress in other fronts. Thank you. Uh, what do you expect from the climate summit that will be held on Monday in New York? Well, I, I think... Sorry, I'm having some concrete uh, pledges and concrete steps from the countries. Well, I, I think I'm also as curious as, as you are. We will hear concrete things. A lot of delegations have inscribed to speak because the very idea has been clear that countries will come and say what they have done. Now, first, it's clear there is a lot to be done because the, we have not really achieved the, the, the target of the reduction of the emissions, but all countries are doing something. What we want to hear uh, on the 23rd is what concrete action each country has done that others can also learn from, including through partnerships. We look forward, all of us, to really that engagement.